Hello, dear viewer, and welcome back to King's Blood with me, Jalanon, at Lunar Nebula Gaming. We survived an orc invasion, but, uh, yeah, this <laughs> level of difficulty might be too much for our next one if we don't have enough mercenaries to throw at them. So I am heavily invested in finding, like, as many followers as possible before our next invasion. And we want to talk to the Witch of Northwest Gastria, which we have found Gastria. We sent a spokesperson there. Hmm, this might be the witch. Seems elven. Okay, we can get more herbs here. And arcanium. A heroic item, too. And an encyclopedia. Huh. So we probably need that for another mercenary or something. Pointy ed criminals. Sorry, eared. Not haired. <laughs> Unless they're anime characters, and everyone has pointy hair, right? Who would have thought of that? Elves being criminals. Well, a band of elven thugs is plundering our roads around western trade route. I know it sounds like a fairy tale, but could you check it out regardless? Sure. Sure, you have a couple water people. Okay, okay. Something to look out for. I have this new and spiffy staff. Which, yeah, looks like it's maybe 10% of its value when you sell it. Wow. There's a lot of value on resale. Okay. Well, we only have this much money. Let's go to the tavern. Throughout the years, there have been countless wars between the feudal states. However, none dare to directly attack Mogar's rest. Everyone knows that if the king falls, the barrier falls with him. Are you familiar with the city of Orleans Grab? It is rumored to be the final resting place of Orlin the Vicious. Yep, we've... Oh, this is new. Grave robbers have since stolen his body, along with his legendary mace, Dark Ember. So that's new to me. We heard about the other part. The energy within the stream of souls is not infinite. It is the embodiment of the consciousness of Fanir, the founding giant. And I think we... yeah, we read this before, too. Hmm. Yeah, that's the kind of cultist guy, okay. The people of Taurus are religious fanatics. Rumors say that they want to start a war with Askia. That sounds great if you ask me. Those demon cultists give me the creeps. Okay, so we have stuff we can do. We're gonna do it. It's gonna take a couple turns. Now, turn 20 should be our next invasion, so yeah, we want to do as many things as possible before then. Okay, we have an elf, we have a shifter. I think we take another elf. Do I take another archer? We get our archery bonus that way. Yeah, we'll do that. And then, another shifter. I don't have my other dwarf, so I think we'll take Gurk again. And I could take you... No, who else has light? You have light? Hmm. You have life as an assassin dwarf. I think we'll go with... Never mind, somebody else is already gone. Hmm. Can I just take my dwarf? Hmm. I was going to take you, summoner guy, but... um, We'll take another archer. Okay. We'll try this group for this. Hopefully it will go well. Maybe. Um, I'd save this for Nagra. Yeah. Hmm. Maybe we just do this now. Mm, but I like the attack damage on my archers. Okay. Well, we will do that for now. Give everybody a potion, just in case. And then think a little bit about this. Do I want to switch anything up? I think the answer is not right now. Focus regen, though. Um, if we get her to mark people early, that might be better. But honestly, her mark only goes for the highest health person first. So, I don't even know if we want that early. Maybe we put it on our... Yeah, we'll do this. We'll do this. Give our dwarf sniper a bunch of attack power. Okay, we'll, we'll just start that quest. And then I need another quest. We're very close to max rep... Well, sort of. With this faction. There is no quest here, never mind. I am sad. Uh, I can't do that one either. Hmm. What about up here still? Hmm. I do still need rep here. Oh, it's still this. Okay. Hmm. Who comes knocking on my door without an invitation? Sorry to interrupt you. But we have heard that you were in company of an old friend of ours not long ago. Who wants to know that? 
Stop screwing around. Just tell us the whereabouts of Raz Duval. <laughs> I see. So, you must be the boy he told me about. And I worked out better than I thought. So you know where he is. Why did he meet up with you? Don't be so pushy. If you don't want to end up as a frog. That's what I expected. Well, we are old friends. And he requested my help. Your help? Well, your uncle, if I may call him that, wanted to enter Riverrun. There are not many ways to go there unharmed. Walls to the north, walls to the south. The only pass is through the mountains, guarded by soldiers. Get to the point. Ever wondered about those portals on your map? I Wait, what? see. So that was his plan. Using the portal north of Friedheim to Riverrum in search for Aura. Exactly. Using the portals is not too hard if you know how. Us Northland witches have kept this wisdom for hundreds of years. Hmm. I led him through the portal. Why waste time? Bring us there as well! You need to be more patient, boy. Back to the story. I led him through the portal, but... As could have been expected, it was guarded and Raz Duval was caught. I barely made it back alive. Rumor is that he is imprisoned in Rotberg and waiting for his execution. Oh, sounds bad. We need to rescue him, please! I've seen it in the bones. It is too dangerous now, but we still have time. Show me your hideout, and let me gather strength for a few nights there. We will figure out a plan on how to rescue your old friend, I'm certain. We... Oui. You heard right. Or who else do you think will guide you through the portals? That's a good point. Yay, we did get a new follower and a summoner. Good, okay. So, she's a halfling. Okay, I wasn't sure because she looks a little old to be an elf, but she could just be an old elf. Hmm, and she's a life person. Okay. Summons two frogs. Okay, so there was once a game where you could get one summoner that kept summoning more and more frogs. It was just pretty broken if you could get that to work. I would like to get that to work. Okay then. Um, so no other quests that I can accept right now, right? No, I just have those two, I think. Yeah. Okay, so that is what we can do. And we can check your skills. Noki's age is unknown, but as halflings are said to age slowly, she must be older than a hundred years. Obviously, she is a witch, but as it turns out, a kind-hearted one. The loss of her siblings has driven her at least a tad bit insane, and she only talks in gibberish rhymes. Didn't seem too insane to me. Her abilities allow her to summon all kind of disgusting animal friends which she creates out of pure arcade energy. Hmm. You think she plays insane to other people so that she doesn't have to deal with them? Because that kind of makes sense to me. Okay, and they get ability power based stuff. And they can explode. Okay, hmm. So I think we're going to go for survivability and ability power on her. Focus regen. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, and we're already constructing something, so hopefully that won't be a problem. I'm still researching my tidal wave. And we don't have enough Arcanium to do anything with Arcanium. Alright. Volkmar. We probably just want more attack damage and stuff. Hmm. Attack speed. I think we'll go this way, because then we can get more attack damage. Okay. And then you. A similar plan for you, Morgul. Is this a Morgul blade? Forged in the fires of Mordor. Okay, anyway, we will see. And then Puck. You already have pretty good critical chance. Let's give you even more. And yeah, we'll keep going for crit damage and crit chance. Seems good. Seems good. Okay, nothing else in our inventory. Alright then. I think we're all set to end our turn. Yoink. 
So one of our quests should be loading up. Alright then. Hmm. So they can deal more damage to Thorb in here. But I do want him in the middle so he can spin to win better. Alright, so Rayo. Just keep you there. Lyrica. Well, we'll move Holdor up. And he's doing extra damage over here, it looks like. And then remind me, Marlo, are you are you ranged? You're a summoner, we know that. No, it looks like you are a melee attacker. Okay, we'll move you up there. We'll have our healer in the back. Alright then. Uh you know what we can do that. This way everybody's engaged. We can upgrade our speed a little bit more. Oh, there's our shadow clone. <laughs> He's punching and kicking. Uh, Alright then. Okay, spin. More crit damage. <laughs> so he did he did say something Bunshin no Jutsu, which is direct Naruto reference. I am not the only one who caught that, I hope. And he can keep summoning. Okay, so that is good to know. Yeah, you want to keep your summoners alive so they can keep summoning. And does the summon have a time limit? Because the frogs explode when they die, but if there's no time limit and it's only if they take enough damage, then we can also swarm a frogs people. Uh, more ability power, more block rate. I think we go for the ability power since we have so many. Nerano told me you wanted to talk. Other. Sit down. I prefer standing. Fine. If that is your wish, so be it. Tell me, Aura. Do you love our kingdom? Couldn't care less. Disappointing, but I expected as much. See, that's the difference between the two of us. I used to love Arthania. But now... I cannot bear the state into which our once noble kingdom has fallen into. I still don't understand what you want from me. Narano told me he spoke with you about your father. He was once a great leader who ruled with an iron fist. And then he went crazy and murdered all of our kind. Indeed. And that has been the only thing in his mind for the last 13 years. The oh. once obedient principalities sense his weakness. They strive for sovereignty. It is only a matter of time before the principalities reach for the crown. But isn't the crown destined for those with royal blood? Why would anyone try to steal the crown if they're not capable to fulfill their duty and uphold the barrier? Politics. You're right. Only king's bloods are fit to rule. But as you yourself should know, Rufus isn't the only one that has the power. Those who still could fled Riverum and went into hiding. They probably crave for revenge after years of exile. So that is what you're afraid of? I am not afraid of anything. The Council of Eldest already granted me full control over our royal armies. Everything is in preparation. But we will need a strong leader after everything is cleansed. Do I understand you right, that you ask me to be the queen of Arthania after my father dies? I would never crawl to anyone and beg. I offer you a chance to earn the crown. Earn it by showing that you deserve to be a leader. <laughs> that is what I offer you. Earn it? But I don't even want it. That is what all of them said at first. If you refuse my offer, you will be executed. If you accept, you will have to compete. Compete? Against whom? Bring them in. M my lord. At your service, my lord. Quite a nice hideout you have set up right here. Oh, well that's Thank you, but shouldn't we kind come of a up with a plan to rescue the rest of all? Well, don't worry. I already have figured everything out. I saw a new traveling point right there behind the trees. We need some granite and arcanium to construct it. 
A traveling pony. Yes, you heard that right. Basically, a small gate empowered by Thermotrogy, allowing you to jump to any known portal. That sounds convenient. Hmm. Then let's do it. I just hope that she knows what she's doing. <laughs> okay. Well, interesting little cutscene. I expected the guy was going to say, I will be king, but I need you to run the barrier for me. So either he's setting up for a long con, or, you know, as we just saw, we're going to have to try to protect her while everybody is aiming for the crown. We have a rare mushroom and a mercenary. Give me that mercenary. There it is. Disgracefully, sending me, Arthania's greatest master chef, to serve some ragged mercenaries? Oh, you must have done something right for our kind, as Major Tom Tom sent me, the Great Bodo, to your support. Whatever, here I am now, and you're gonna get all kinds of delicious food. Such a waste for unappreciative primitives like you, but I guess it is what it is. We have a number of halflings now. Wait a second, you're a specialist? Place a barricade with the group's ability power and hit points. Place a turret? Place two turrets? I love it. Okay, Master Cook, he buffs attack damage and ability power of all his group members. For five seconds and heals all allies. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, so I... I think that's interesting about him. I doubt you do much damage. But, uh... Fascinating. Okay, so we have another quest we can do. It'll take two more turns. It's gonna be a quest. Seems simple enough. We do still want a reputation. I see a mushroom. Okay. Um, clean up the mines. Okay. Stop this place is under the control of Riverum's army. If we find out that you are involved in rebellious activities, you will be executed on the spot. Having said that, you are currently allowed to support the largest army in all of Arthania. Some of the line shafts near Wanderer's death have been infested with bugs and beetles. Just a job for maggots like you. Go and get rid of these pests and you might earn some coins. Maybe. If I deign to let you. Okay. Um, so we have two summoners now. Yeah. I like that. And it's 33% bonus to like most of their stats that's insane okay so we want that to work for that to work we're going to need some tanks remind me you're fire aren't you yes okay so do light hmm and we can still only have five members of our group maybe we take bodo bodo we get a halfling synergy that way we could take Puck. He's an assassin. Hmm. No, I think we take Bodo. Okay, we'll, we'll try that. Hmm. I want to give you a crazy good staff. And you... Hmm. I don't know what I'm going to give you. Increases ability power by one. So many people I want to give this sea mushroom to. So many. Hmm. I don't know what feels the most broken yet in this game, so we're gonna wait. <laughs> gonna wait on you, mushroom. Oh, but one day you will be delicious, I'm sure. We're gonna do this on Bodo. And then... Yeah, we have a healer, we have two summoners, we have this guy. It should be fine. I should double check what Noki's attack range is at some point, but for now we're gonna start our quest. It should be pretty simple, it's just bugs. Whoever had problems with bugs? Everyone. Oh, okay. We're still doing our pointy eared criminals quest. Oh, and this sea mushroom literally doesn't gain us any money if we sell it. Interesting. We could just buy some herbs. One herb for 60. That's an option. I don't care for it at the moment. Okay, and then we have this. Where in Mo Jarl's name are those lazy men who call themselves soldiers where we truly need them? The orcs and elves are close to war. Ogres enslave people without consequence. The dwarves are getting uppity, and goodness knows what's going on in the south. Everything's going to pot, and there's nothing we can do but try to fend for ourselves. Buy a round for the crowd for 30 gold. The sudden appearance of the undead is chilling, isn't it? It was a ravenous tsunami of monsters the day they'd swarmed, like they had spent hundreds of years obsessing over how we taste. They must have come from the barrier. There must be something wrong with it to allow those things to break through. 
to make matters worse. I don't know if Riverum can be trusted any longer. Okay, and uh, we learned that about the Dark Ember. Once, while I was picking berries close to Middlestadt, I stumbled upon some overgrown stone plates within the forest. This place filled my heart with an overwhelming sense of dread, so I ran. Probably a good plan. Hmm. I do want to work on constructing a traveling point at some point. Let's see, Bodo. What do we want to give you? Just not dying? The ability to not die? Seems pretty good. And AP. Okay. Strawberry truffle and the head of three mice. Mix it up with some Ascian spice. Give it some roasted more gruel root. Fast. Taste some of Bodo's food. Liver and heart and even a spine. Don't be disgusted. It will be fine. Touching that tongue will be so, so good. Hooray. Taste some of Bodo's food. Polly through a stab at spice. Sorry. The little goulash caviar and risotto rice. Bodo will cook if you give him loot. Buy Mo Yaro. Taste some of Bodo's food. Apparently. Okay, then. Hmm. I want you to not die. How do I keep you from dying? Uh, oh, you do have a ranged attack. Are you going to throw knives? <laughs> it will be hilarious. Hmm. I think we go for this middle, mostly. And then that is more focus regeneration, so I am going to go this way. You don't have much crit chance, so this feels a little bit meh, but oh well, oh well. We'll do what we can with Bodo's food. Give you armor. Okay, and Lyrica. What do you need, friend? Other than not dying. Not dying, yet again, is pretty good for you. I also want that focus regen. I can get health regen. It's probably not enough to keep us alive, so I'm gonna go for magic resistance. And we'll try to go this away, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Could try to go for more health region on this side, though. Anyway, anyway. I think we're good. I think we are good. Other than I should double check. Can I construct anything else at the moment? No. Also, no. Could make a bunch more potions, but I'd rather get the good potions. So we're going to wait. All right. Anything else to think about? Just double checking, we've already got our quests, yep. Okay, I think we are happy, so we're gonna go. Go for it. It's turn 13. I'm gonna find some more battles. Hmm. Danger. Hmm. I think we rush the archers, because if we can take them down quickly, that will be a boon for us. Could do this. That is true. You are leaping thieves. If you leap this way, that could actually be kind of good for us. Hmm. There's our sniper. We're going to put her in the middle. Are you good against any specific? No. Let's put you here-ish, then. Hmm. You're gonna go over here? What if I do this? That seems kind of fine. Let's see, they should leap... like that. Yeah. That kind of worked out. I think we'll be okay if Finya can get enough time to shapeshift, which... looks like we're doing. Maybe. Nah, she needs more focus. Hmm. More armor too, maybe? I might have focused too hard on just random ability power. Okay. But we get good stuff. Max health plus 46 seems pretty good. Huh. But attack damage 20. Attack damage 20. Okay. Hey, crew. The construction of the portal needs tons of stone. Okay. We can acquire some stone by gaining some reputation in Ashalador. As far as I know, they sit on massive sources of granite. Okay. Sounds good. What about the Arcanium, though? I didn't even know that stuff existed. I'm not sure either. Never heard of Arcanium before. We have a forge for it, guys. <laughs> Once again, I can be of service, I guess. Arcanium can be acquired by extracting and manifesting arcane powers bound with magical artifacts. 
You mean those that we sometimes find on our missions? Exactly. Though, for our portal, this might not be enough. We need something more powerful. Okay. But I already have a plan. Boy, my arm. This old lady's always one step ahead. I was told the orcs in Orktar possess an ancient demon skull. If we would help them out, they might be willing to hand over that skull to us. Huh. That skull hold an enormous source of Arcanium. <laughs> All right, then we got a plan. Let's befriend Okatarar and Ashalador and hope we get the things we need to start constructing that traveling platform. I mean, it is a plan. But they're all to the south, aren't they? Man, I'm glad I started over here instead of up top. Hmm. So yeah, we need... Remind me. Ashalador. Where is Orktaar? Okay, well we can construct something else now. Can I make my cool shrine thing? No. Trophy. Increases crit damage by 10%. So are these like... Let's bring one more combatant to battle? Yes, we're getting that. Okay. Um... Yeah, I was just thinking, it seemed like they were minor bonuses, so maybe we have to put a person in there to do an action before we get those bonuses for three turns. But three turns isn't half bad. Uh, how do I... Hmm. I want to I wanna make you, but okay. Uh, maybe I should get Trap Disarm real fast, because I do want more of these. Hmm. How do I... Now this is just for... Hmm. I'm kind of confused at the moment because it looks like I can only use herbs to make any items. I don't... I don't understand how that makes a tidal wave, but okay. Um, maybe I should wait. I guess I'll wait. Maybe there's different qualities of each item as well. Hmm. Could be, could be. Critical chance. Let's increase your crit chance. Yeah. Seems pretty good. Hmm. Magnus, more attack speed or crit chance? I'll give you crit chance as well. Tara. Hmm. I wanted to get you a bunch of attack damage. We can also give you crit chance, though. And this goes to a, several good spots. So, we'll do that. We'll do that. And then try this quiz once again. Orlin. We know that. So I think the only one I haven't done is fire. Right? Fire or life? Fire? <laughs> okay, one day, by process of elimination, I think we found it to be life. But anyway. Okay, anything else I could do here? Ooh. Oh, so it's you. You've become quite famous around the streets of Gastria. The people praise you. The criminals are getting nervous. Listen, I should probably be afraid of you as well. I have not been the nicest person throughout my life. But I am not afraid. I know that we have a common goal. I know some of you hate these river run scums as much as I do. So let's work together and start the rebellion this kingdom needs. Huh. Well, they just warned us about Rebellion. We have another archer this way, and a halfling with light. Okay. We'll take you. Thank you, Lex. Okay, and then you. Green skin scab tools. Okay, let's do this. Hmm. Wait, what? Why did it say Nagra was unconscious? Okay, well. Apparently not, so that's good. Um, I don't have any other orcs at the moment. I can get another elf in you, and then we have our new archer, so we'll take our halfling archer, and then we could take another halfling, hmm, Bodo's taken, we'll take you. Even though we don't have our shifter bonus, we still have a halfling bonus, so I think that's fine. Let's see, we can get more attack damage on somebody, 
Like, let's do this. Yeah, we'll do that. Um, and we can just get more attack damage on people. Good fit. There we go. Hmm. Maybe I feed this to Niagara. How do I, how do I do that? Huh. Looks like it has to have an open slot for somebody to be using it. And right-clicking works. Good uh. fit. Well, we're doing that. Anyway. Oh, uh, let's get more health potions on everybody. Right-clicking also works there. Cool. Hmm. And then we'll think about life. Life is fine. We go on our next journey. Okay, and then you. More half wizards to worry about. Finya, Ryo, and everybody. We have enough shifters now. Uh, I could take another dwarf. And then we have more fire as well. Yeah. Or... Hmm. Let's take Morgul, just to see what he's like. Uh, and I think we're pretty happy about that. I do need to give Morgul that. Okay, and now we have three groups. Let us check out our unspent skill points. Who? You. Okay. So, you are mostly going to need attack damage and ability power. And it does more ability power stuff, so we're going to try to focus ability power on Lex. Gastria, the most influential free city in Arthania, and a good place to make some quick bucks. Lex used to be a bandit committing minor crimes like theft and burglary during her youth. One night, a group from Riverum appeared in the city. They seemed to have enjoyed too much of Gastria's wine. As they lay down for rest, the young kids along Lex broke into their chambers to empty the drunk's pockets. Lex was waiting outside. Her friends never returned. As it turned out, both Jolosh and Garrick had been caught and decapitated on the spot. Mortius, the name of the culprit. Since then, Lex holds a deep grudge against Riverum forces and offers her work as a mercenary not only for the money, but also for training her skills for the day she gets her revenge. Despite this dramatic event while growing up, she has manifested an impressive self-esteem and won't shut her loud and often rude mouth even when facing opponents double her size. Well, considering she can shoot them far away, that kind of makes sense. Um, I think we're going to go this way to get more attack damage and crit buffs. Yeah, and then we'll go for attack speed next. Okay. I think it is a plan. And I think we're ready. Yes? Okay. Good. There we go. So. I'm going to scoot you guys. Hmm. You can help out, Finya. Where do I want you? Probably here. Are you leapers? No, you're throwing rocks at us. Okay, are you a leaper? No. Hmm. So yeah, we can focus their front line and probably destroy them quickly. We'll do that. Kind of get a little bit of back line attack. Ryo, though. Ah, oh, he's going down. Okay. Well, we took more damage than I'd hoped. Let's see. Yeah. This person took... A ton of damage, 1,674. Does that include their summons, maybe? Huh. Okay, whereas damage dealt, my goodness, Magnus. Champion. Champion, indeed. We can get a Hat of Meditation, more ability power. I want to take the Hat of Meditation, because I think that'll be useful. Okay. Loading battleground. <laughs> Okay, where do we want you? Here-ish? Hmm, I can do this. I'm gonna try, focus this guy on the corner. Uh, hmm. Do I do this? That seems kind of crazy. So crazy, it's just my work. Good. Okay, and then I will try to keep an eye on our health. Yeah, as I figured, our man in the corner needed some help. And Gurk might transform in time. Okay, he did transform in time. Kind of hilariously. Okay. For our assassin, wow. Fulkmar. 
show them exactly why he's called an assassin. Good work, you. Good work. Yeah, second best attack damage. Even had to deal with most of the enemies. <laughs> oh, crit rate plus 19% seems pretty good. So you know what? We'll, we'll try that. We have enough assassins and stuff now. That seems good. Okay. Askian magic. Hope you are not forced into a pact. Hmm. You know, I wouldn't be able to talk about it, even if it was true. <laughs> hmm. Intrigue. So maybe people that share synergy bonuses always have stuff to talk about together. Huh. Intriguing. Okay, well, we're doing this for sure. Um, you can help over here. Because I think we're going to break through on the right more easily. All right. We'll see how this goes. So I think I just saw the pot go off, and then frog exploded. Do they have... No, they only have one range. Okay. So that's important to note, is our summoners on a squished map like this aren't going to do the best. But Bodo is doing great work here. Good work, Bodo. With our poor shadows are just doing nothing. Good work, team. Good work. We got through it eventually. All right, then. Let's see healing. Like, we had Lyrica and Bodo. Yeah. Oh, Marlo took the most damage. And we were doing okay, though. Doing okay. Thorbin, yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> okay, then. Gloves of Quickness, Ability Power 27. Hmm. I think we take more Ability Power. Have you come to a decision yet? I don't know. I don't want to die, but I just could never see myself as a queen. I disagree. You would be a great leader. Listen to me, Nerano. Every night, I see the image of Rilka getting stabbed. Oh. How can I stand for something I detest so deeply? It was the forces of the Crown who committed this crime. So you lack motivation. Dead fly that has Grimm? nothing to do with motivation. Oh, yes it has. What was that? You look shocked. Did something happen? The fly. It just moved. A uh, fly? Ah, that little beast. I thought I squashed it. It was annoying me. Don't tease me! You know you just killed it! My dear Aura, there might be secrets you don't understand yet. Anyways, it is already late. I have to go now. Wait, you dropped something! What is this? A book? It looks so old and ancient. Suddenly, Aura feels an unnatural curiosity. Mm. Okay, well, she's going to try to resurrect her sister, which, you know what? Motivation. Bad guys know what motivates. All right then, dear viewer. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe if you're enjoying King's Blood. And I hope you have a great day.